morning. For six-year-old David Fangaro, these are the first steps toward a new life. Without legs or a right hand, some might dwell on what's missing. But the Challenge Athletes Foundation focuses on what's not, the dream to compete. Yeah. Not very light, huh? For David, it's the chance to run fast. How fast? Faster than a cheetah. <laughs> Faster than a cheetah? All he's wanted to do is run. And now he has the tools to run, and I don't think he knows where it's going to take him. Yeah. And it's going to take him everywhere. The foundation has given out more than $90 million in grants since 1994. They funded more than half the U.S. athletes at this year's Paralympics. You're giving someone a piece of equipment, and that equipment is going to change their lives, their families' lives, and really their destination. David Rizal is a real Iron Man. He lost his right leg to a landmine. I realized I was going to have a battle. It wasn't a quick fix. It wasn't a quick replacement. CAF helped him back on his feet. Rizal returned to Iraq to command his troops, then on to competition. When I did Iron Man in 2006, when my division, I knew that there were thousands, if not millions of people that were watching me and saying, now that's a role model for my recovery. Inspiring others, now part of the routine, with the idea that heroes come in all shapes and sizes, when big dreams are given new legs. What do you want to do with us? Race every single person in the world. <laughs> now that race can finally begin. Steve Patterson, NBC News, San Diego.